hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel if you're here for the first time please make sure you hit the like button and subscribe thank you so much today we have huawei p40 light and i'm gonna show you what is going on with this p40 light okay you see when i switch off the phone it was touching actually this phone has uh huawei id but the screen has been replaced because the screen has been replaced and the screen is not the original 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 screen so the screen has a problem that would not allow us to format this phone okay that will not allow us to remove the password i'm going to show you right now you're going to see what i'm talking about so I'm, i want to boot to recovery mode i hold the power button and volume up when the Hawaii logo shows i release the power button and here i am now when i press clear data because that's where that's the option you will use to factory reset the phone to hard reset the phone actually so i try to use the the keypads the volume up and down and the power button but something strange happens okay the screen is not touching all right i press the yes button to continue but it's not showing so i'm going to teach you how to remove the password and do a y id on this phone okay so guys make sure you hit the like button and subscribe all right let's open up the phone real quick real quick real quick without wasting time all right disconnect the battery we're gonna connect the battery back right now guys hit that like button hit that like button and subscribe now here is our edl cable edl cable if you want to know how to make this edl cable this is the only cable and the battery is connected this is the only cable that can connect this device on test point mode okay normal cable will not connect this phone on test point mode because the software has the latest security patch all right guys so here is the test point here is where you're going to connect to the ground that dot right there to the ground and you come to your device manager and you must see on the ports on the hardware section why com 1.0 okay you are why usb com 1.0 that should show and the software i'm using is called sigma sigma plus okay sigma plus you go to their website www.sigmakey.com you get this software and selecting the processor i silicon 810 now clicking the reset or y id right there ladies and gentlemen the process has begun all right this is a process you can use to format you press yes over there is the process you can use to format the phone I mean, doing add reset at the same time, removing the Hawaii uh, ID lock on this particular phone. All right, guys. So the process has started and is going right now. Now, let's wait for. Yes. So this is saying if you are using a modified cable, that's the ideal cable. You can press OK. All right. You press OK at that point. It's going to write connecting. When it's right connecting then this is what you are going to do you go to that port where you install the usb port and you remove it and plug it back immediately then the process will continue all right this is a trick you should know oh my god you should know this trick guys let's go let's go let's go make sure you hit that like button and subscribe hit that like button and subscribe to this channel for more amazing content on this channel you are going to witness some amazing teachings all right some stuff that are very 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 educative all right on this channel so make sure you share this channel also to your friends to technician friends and let's get this channel up and running don't forget to hit that like button and the process is completed right now ladies and gentlemen all right that's my ideal cable we need to wait for the phone to factory set right now so this happens automatically when you do your YID remover, okay? Factory reset, low level. Let's go. This is the ideal cable. If you want to learn how to, if you want to know how to learn how to make this type of cable, please, I'm going to leave a link in the, in the description below. Click it and learn how to do that cable yourself. Without that cable, this phone cannot cannot connect on EDL mode because it has latest security patch all right so let's continue the setup the Huawei ID is successfully removed and the phone is successfully formatted 
all right if you are witnessing if you're experiencing this type of problem that the screen is not touching after you replace the screen okay i mean if you want to factory reset the phone and the screen is not touching this method is very very effective okay so connect your internet and we are going to continue the setup right now all right guys make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to this channel ladies and gentlemen let's go man you press next 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 don't have a yd yes maybe later leave you press later right now later scroll up and press agree skip no thanks later later and later enable and continue then you press later right here later set up try gesture and cancel it finish guys i'm going to see you in the next video and we are done peace